Do you want to sync content between your Mac and your iPhone? Also works with your iPad. I'm gonna show you how to do it. The first thing to note is that the first time you set up syncing, you must connect using a physical cable, a USB or USB-C cable. Okay, I've got an iPhone 11 here, and so I'm just gonna connect it with this cable here. Okay, so if you look here in my Finder window, as soon as I connect this cable to my iPhone, should discover there we go Anthony's iPhone so that's nice and easy or to skip the backup I'll just skip it at the moment okay and then at this point I can copy uh, audio books music movies all sorts of things I'm going to copy books here so I've got a book that I know which is uh, on my iPhone itself in fact I'm going to sync all books let me do that you've got all of these options here photos apps documents and data and I'm just going to click sync here for books I'm going to skip the backup again of course you can do the backup and now we can see that this is transferring from the iPhone and there we go we're done of course it's going to depend on what books and movies and everything you've got here so let's have a look at books I'll see if I've got a new book in here. Okay, I've brought in no audio books or PDFs, but if I look into books there, I can see that this book has just come in and uh, that's come straight across from my iPhone. Now check this link in the description to find a bit more background about syncing content between your Mac and your iPhone or your iPad. And you may need to check what version of Mac OS you are running. I'm running Monterey 12 at the time of recording this.